I'll tell you, Mr. Chairman, I want to believe the people, not the Gwich'in, because they're not the people. Listen to the people who live there. If not, you're not representatives at all. That's all I ask you to do. Listen to them. Hear what they say. Not someone is living in Fairbanks. And I'd like to make something very, very clear to this audience and to everybody out there that's listening. And that's Mr. Don Young does not rep represent the Gwich'in. He does not represent the Gwich'in in our voice. I represent he might, Alaska. I he represent might, Alaska. I don't he represent might, you. He might have you don't a wife represent that was Gwich in, You but don't he does represent, not the represent the Gwich'in. I am here. I am here because the elders have sent me to be here. So I want to be clear on that. You know, somebody's telling me I get to take a trip around the world. I got that invitation years ago. It's called the U.S. Army. When I did my three tours in Iraq, so I've seen plenty of the world, and I don't need somebody to send me else out where. And so you think about that. I've been to combat. I know what war is like. And I came home, and I see my people under attack, and so what do I do? I do what a warrior does, and I go where my people send me, and that's here. That's what I'm here to do, is to represent us as which in people, as the warriors that we are. So let's be clear on that. You think about the oil industry and the influence that they have. Imagine that we're here, and we're not getting paid to be here. I got a seven-month-old son. If you think I want to be here more than I want to be with my son, you're out of your mind. We are making sacrifices. I pay for my trip being down here with my veteran's disability. I make sacrifice. Everybody you see here makes sacrifices to be here. And so to say that we're doing this because we're going to get some sort of trip is an insult.